Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Electricity and we're here to discuss the subject of toxic electricity and that is LED light bulbs. So this particular LED light bulb is connected to the main system right now. We actually have the oscilloscope recording the current waveform going out to that light bulb. And as you can see, it's highly distorted. So that causes harmonics. So currently our scale is set to 500 millivolts per division in the vertical direction and five milliseconds in the horizontal direction per division. So let's have a look at the fast Fourier transfer function. So we can see there's a number of harmonics on there. So let's extend that out a little bit. So you can see that they're all bunched up into this area and this display right now is displaying one kilohertz per division. So they're all centered below about five kilohertz. We expand out to 250 hertz per division. We can see the individual harmonic spikes. So what I want to do now is I want to put the lamp dimmer on. So we're going to have to change outlets. So this is our dimming outlet. And we actually have the waveform. And you see the waveform is very, very different. We're on a very low dimming setting right now. And if I slowly increase that, we should see the current start to increase. So the thing you'll notice is it's drawing its current in spikes from the electrical system. And when you do that, you put harmonics onto the system. So we're getting a current waveform that's quite similar to what we had earlier on full brightness. So let's have a look at the harmonics. So our harmonics are quite different. So right now we're on 250 hertz per division in the horizontal direction and 20 decibels per division in the vertical direction. So you see we have a lot of harmonics in there. Let's extend that out a little bit and see what we get. So they're much further out now it's on the lamp dimmer. So we're on two and a half kilohertz per division right now. And they're probably extending much further than 10 kilohertz right now. So this section right here is kind of where all the harmonic energy is centered. So let's vary the lamp dimmer and see what we get. So you can see the harmonics vary according to the dimming setting that you have. And you can get quite extensive harmonics simply by changing the dimming setting. It's much quieter when it's on its dimmest. But yeah, it seems to have a lot of noise at mid-brightness. So let's go and take a look at what this waveform looks like. So we need to adjust our time base. So our time base right now is on two and a half milliseconds per division in the horizontal direction. And we're on 500 millivolts per division in the vertical direction. So let's vary our brightness. So we're on full brightness right now. We're going to take it down. So you can see that the waveform really gets very, very large current spikes on it. So this, this is an undesirable product from the point of harmonics because those current spikes are very abnormal for loads to be taken from the AC electrical system and will be contaminating the AC electrical system. So we're back on to full brightness. So as you can see, this particular product does indeed produce harmonics. And they can be quite extensive, particularly when it's used on a lamp dimmer. I hope you enjoyed the presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.